Mesh Wi-Fi systems are growing in popularity all over the world, but are they good for gaming and will give you an advantage over the competition or leave you stuck at the bottom of the leaderboard? We'll talk about all of this and more in today's video. Hey everyone, it's Chris here from HomeNetworkGeek.com where we talk about everything home networking. If you enjoy the video and you find it helpful, I'd really appreciate it if you drop it a like, subscribe to the channel and ring the bell to turn on notifications. Now let's jump straight in with how mesh Wi-Fi even works. Mesh Wi-Fi works by placing the main central router somewhere in your home that connects directly into your modem. And then a series of other devices known as satellite modules or nodes are placed all over the home to provide full Wi-Fi coverage. Unlike a traditional router, all of the devices involved in making mesh Wi-Fi work share the same SSID and password for you to connect. Now you may be asking how mesh Wi-Fi is actually different to your basic Wi-Fi extender, as from that description, they sound like they pretty much do the same job. That is true in the sense that mesh Wi-Fi does the same job in extending the Wi-Fi coverage throughout your home, but mesh Wi-Fi systems don't actually come with the hassle that often comes with Wi-Fi extenders. They're much, much easier to set up. With mesh Wi-Fi, it really is as easy as connecting all the devices and then following a few simple steps in the accompanying app. After doing this, you'll have full coverage in no time. The main reason for mesh Wi-Fi not being ideal for gaming is that the internet speeds you receive won't be able to be maintained across your entire home. The wireless signal emitted will degrade as it moves further and further away from the point of origin, which in this case is the main router. Mesh Wi-Fi works by having the main router emit a wireless signal, which the other nodes then pick up and have to amplify as they rebroadcast it. The further that you find yourself from the origin of the signal, the main router, the poorer the signal quality will be and the likelihood of latency does increase. Now as mesh Wi-Fi is designed and marketed towards your average consumer that just wants a better Wi-Fi signal throughout their entire home, you'll find that mesh Wi-Fi does lack some of the advanced features that gamers will look for in a router. This could include making use of both the 2.4 and 5 gigahertz frequency bands, changing the DHCP scope, or adding custom DNS. Mesh Wi-Fi systems are designed to be incredibly easy to set up and manage, so gamers may miss out on optimizing their network performance for the best gaming experience. Now, mesh Wi-Fi systems also aren't cheap. If you have a particularly large home and need a number of different nodes, you could look at having to spend several hundreds of dollars to provide coverage for the entire home. So if gaming is your number one priority, you're probably better off getting a router that's been designed specifically with gamers in mind, and then purchase an additional wireless access point or perhaps a Wi-Fi extender should you need it. And this will likely still cost less than a mesh Wi-Fi system, which isn't designed for gamers in the first place. So if mesh Wi-Fi isn't the best choice for gamers, what can it actually be good for? If gaming isn't your number one priority, there are actually several reasons as to why a mesh Wi-Fi system may be perfect for you and your home network. One of the main reasons to consider a mesh Wi-Fi system is that they do an excellent job at improving the Wi-Fi coverage throughout your entire home. Unlike a traditional router, you don't have to worry about placing it somewhere and then finding that the signal doesn't quite reach each corner of the home. The mesh Wi-Fi nodes work together to provide better coverage wherever you may be in your home at the time. Again, unlike traditional routers with range extenders, you don't have to worry about maintaining different network connections and having to hop across different access points. Mesh Wi-Fi maintains a single SSID and password wherever you may be in your home at the time. They are intelligent enough to automatically connect you to the best node for optimal connectivity and performance. In a mesh Wi-Fi network, there is no main access point, and so there isn't a single point of failure. Now, of course, you will still need the main router connected to the modem and to have a working internet connection, but should one of the nodes fail, the mesh Wi-Fi system will continue to function. All of the nodes used in a mesh Wi-Fi network are alike, so should one fail for any reason, you can simply replace it without having to worry about the entire network coming crashing down. This is similar to how you can replace a faulty hard drive in a NAS and still be able to access all of the data on the other hard drives. The fact that mesh Wi-Fi systems are incredibly easy to set up is one of the main reasons for their recent spike in popularity. For those that aren't particularly interested in the nuts and bolts of setting up and maintaining a home network, 
Mesh Wi-Fi systems are great as they're easy to set up and simple to maintain. Mesh Wi-Fi systems can also be as large or as small as you'd like. Now the size of your home is likely to determine how big the mesh Wi-Fi system will actually be. Each node is its own module within the whole network so it has no dependency on the other nodes. This means they can easily be added or removed whenever necessary. And the fact that there's very little setup needed to add additional nodes is nice. So to wrap up the video, mesh Wi-Fi systems can be excellent for your average consumer, but for gamers, you probably wanna look at an alternative solution. That being said, if you are a casual gamer that plays casual games or plays offline a lot of the time, you can still get away with using a mesh Wi-Fi system and be perfectly happy. But for you competitive gamers out there that need a fast and stable network connection and a low latency and low ping, you probably wanna look at something else. Mesh Wi-Fi simply hasn't been designed with gamers in mind. So you competitive gamers, you're better off looking for a router or a system that's been designed with you in mind that contains the advanced features to optimize your experience and often for a lower price of the mesh Wi-Fi. So I hope you found this video and found it helpful. If you did, it'd be great if you could drop it a like, subscribe to the channel, and ring the bell to turn on notifications. Don't forget to head on over to homenetworkgeek.com where I've got a ton of articles on everything home networking. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.